to my channel already i sound pretty sick i know but i've been resting the entire day and i was so so bored so i decided to shoot who am i this is literally my third video this week and i hope it's not too much i finally took a nice shower and i'm feeling much better now my throat is still bad but my fever is gone i did my hair and i feel much much better now i'm quickly just going to moisturize my skin i do not have the energy for a you know full on skincare routine i just want my skin to be hydrated it's like super dry whenever i get sick my skin gets super super dry my lips have also been very dry the literally the entire layer is gone and it kind of hurts so i'm going to use a new lip balm today it's the derma kos 1% kojic acid lip balm first of all look at the packaging it looks so cute it's like a capsule this is how it looks it's fragrance free applies beautifully on the lips there are not much products in the indian market that help with lip pigmentation But the Derma Kos 1% Kojic Acid Lip Balm is the ultimate solution for dark pigmented lips. Apart from 1% Kojic Acid, it also contains alpha arbutin which controls the production of melanin resulting in a brighter and more uniform lip color. These lip balms contain SPF 30 PA++ to protect our lips from the sun and hyaluronic acid for hydration. We have one more variant in this and it's the 1% ceramide complex lip balm. If you have really rough, dry and chapped lips, then this is the one that you should go for. It also contains vitamin E and provides the perfect amount of nourishment that your lips need. I would also like to mention that the Derma Co has empowered 10,000 plus students this year with their Young Scientists initiative. So every time you buy from them, they will link your order to one child that they help educate along with Bhumi. And the best part is you can use my code for a discount on your purchase. Now that I'm done with my face, I'm going to do something for my body. And I went through all your recommendations by the way, um you know, about what videos you want to see. So, first of all about the fashion recommendations, my style is as minimal as it gets. I'm a very very basic girl. I literally I just I mostly wear black and otherwise I'm just in my pajamas. and yeah my jewelry is so minimal i'm mostly just wearing pearl studs maybe like a gold chain once in a while and i do not like to you know experiment a lot with my style i can make a video some day but right now i'm too tired to think about it and about food videos i wanted to talk about food videos not a lot of you wanted to see food videos why you don't like food or you just don't like watching them i'm so confused about it i really enjoyed making food videos but then eventually i also reduced because i did not feel a lot of you were interested in food videos so many of you wanted to know my body care routine and i can do a proper video on my body care routine but on most days it's just a very nice hydrating moisturizer or body lotion after my shower currently i'm using this one this one is not very thick it's pretty light but it gets absorbed into my skin quickly and that's honestly what i need right now i do not have much energy to put into applying my lotion so yeah also really love this this is the palmers coco butter formula with vitamin e smells like coco butter gets a little too strong sometimes but it's a very thick and nice body lotion if you're looking for one especially now that winter is coming this is so good it's really thick it's really buttery and i i love body butters so i got the dyson yes i got the dyson air wrap and i did a lot of thinking for more than 6 months and then i finally finally got it I really wanted to make an unboxing video. Oh my god, my phone. I really wanted to make an unboxing video and like a first impressions video, but I got sick then and did not have the energy to do it. It's so heavy the entire box. And I had the Philips straightening brush before this and I love that too, but that just flattens my hair and this Dyson gives me some volume. So that's that's what I can say for now. I will eventually make a video about it about 
you know if it's worth it or not i'm just i'm just so grateful that i get to do what i love and this youtube community is such a beautiful beautiful community i could never i had never imagined that this will be so different from instagram it's a feeling of community all of you actually telling me your real thoughts and all of it it's just so heartwarming and it's literally what i needed during these sick days so thanks a lot for all your wishes and all your texts it makes me very very happy i'm quickly going to go make dinner for myself i'm really craving some nice gooey upma i saw it on instagram and i just can't stop thinking about it now so i'm going to go make that i'll catch you in a bit and spend some time with everyone i feel better after eating but now i'm going to take some steam this is the steamer that i'm using it's from agaro i got it from amazon and it's it's the best steamer ever it's so convenient to use and it's just perfect you can lift it up and use it there's no hassle i'm also watching a uh, sex ed you can see in the reflection i am on the last episode the season is going to end Now I'm liking it a little bit but it's still not better than the last season or the ones before that it's just fine I'm I think once I'm done with this I'm going to start watching suits I was watching Ginny and Georgia last week and it was so good I loved it and if you know any other show like Ginny and Georgia then please let me know because it's so sad when a show comes to an end I hate it. So please drop down your recommendations of whatever Netflix shows and movies you've watched. That's really gonna help me pass some time. Yeah. 